Oh guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix Rainbow Six Siege stuttering and freezing. So first of all, you want to go on your uh, launcher. So I'm going to go on Steam, right click on the game, go to properties, and then go to install files and verify integrity of the game files. This will verify any missing files uh, and corrupt files and basically fix it. Another thing to do is go to general and disable in-game overlay. Now, if that didn't fix the problem, you want to go to install files again, go to browse. And on here, you want to go ahead and scroll to the bottom of the page until you see Rainbow Six EXE file. Right click on it, go to properties, compatibility, and you want to check run this program as administrator, disable full screen optimizations and run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8, then apply and OK. Now, if that didn't fix the problem still, you want to add your game to Windows Defender Firewall to go through it. Uh, so we're going to click Allow an App, then change the settings. Then you're going to uh, search for Rainbow Six Siege. So you should see this file and Rainbow Six Siege Launcher. Make sure they are here. If not, you're going to click Allow Another App, Browse. Then you're going to go, for me it is on a Steam. Steam games, uh, then Steam apps, common, um, Tom Clancy's here, and Rainbow Six Siege here. And you're gonna add it. Now, if that didn't fix the problem, you're gonna open your virus and threat protection and you're gonna add an exclusion. Here, manage settings, add an exclusion. Click yes, and you're gonna add it here uh, like we did with Windows Defender Firewall. You also want to go ahead and check for updates on your Windows and also you want to open up your GPU. So I use NVIDIA and uh, on drivers, if there's any uh, ready drivers, you want to go ahead and download them. Another thing to try out if none of that worked, go to graphic settings. On graphic settings, you want to go ahead and search for um, the game, Rainbow Six and you want to go ahead and choose high performance right there. Another thing to try out is open up your NVIDIA control panel. Go to manage 3D settings and then you're going to scroll down until you see shader catch uh, size and you want to go ahead and disable it and see if the problem was fixed. Now if your game is opened now, uh, you want to go ahead and go to the task manager and then you want to go ahead and find the game. So I don't have it opened now, but basically you're going to um, right click on it and then click on go to details. After that, you're going to find the game exe file and you want to go ahead and set priority to high. And the last thing to try out is go to your documents, uh, then go to my games, uh, to the game here and game settings. Uh, then you're going to open it here and you want to go ahead and find FPS limit. It will be at the top and you want to set your FPS limit to the frame rate of your monitor. If this video was helpful, make sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.